Let's start in this video to talk about cherry pick. Cherry pick is a git command that give it to us the opportunity to take one specific commit from one specific branch and copy that to another branch. It means we don't want to merge both branches, but we would like to take just one specific brain, specific commit inside a branch and move to another one. So what we are going to do here from the zero, we are going to create a new repository. We are going to we are going to create a new branch. Then we are going to create another branch. The third step. Then we are going to switch to check out to the second branch. Here we are going to perform two commits. Perform commit A and and perform commit B. Then we are going to move back to first branch and then finally we don't want to have this commit B, the last version of the code. We want to have the commit A, so we need to cherry pick just commit A. So perform cherry pick on commit A. So that's our roadmap. Now let's do that from zero. So let's suppose this directory here will be our git project. So we just copy that. We are going to open our console. So just with that open here. Okay, right. Now we enter in the directory we are going to work on. Here we are, git init, first instruction. Now we have the git directory created. We have this written folder here. Now, now we have here, if we type git branch, we, ha we have git branch. Okay, it should list to us here. Git branch. It should to list to us here the existing branch, but it has not. So probably we need to have first one initial commit here. So just a moment. Let's create it here. Let's add. Let's add this file here. Git status. We have this cherry pick, cherry pick file that is uncommitted, and then we are going to use git add. And now the first commit. Git commit minus m and then here we have the um, first version first version it's it's the, the draft version of our code now now probably it has created here the the master the um, branch so just take a look if now if git branch yes now we have master here being displayed good now let's suppose we want to have a second branch we want then to use here git check count actually git print then here minus minus b and then the new branch like print b okay so it's not minus b it was to create the new branch. I'll try without the minus b. Okay, I think probably it has. Yes, now it has created the, the branch b without the, the command, the, the parameter. Now we're going to switch to, to branch b. Git checkout. 
check out print print b okay now we are here you can take a look if you type git print you can see we are in print b and now we are going to edit two times our two commits in this branch we can open this cherry, cherry pick now let's suppose here before create the new branch i have forget to do one step here that is to do the first commit what we have done together then now it's a modified file you can see here git status we have this modification so again git add dot git commit minus m then here the message added one dot one step okay so now let's suppose we also would like to have another change here let's suppose do the first commit but before actually it's just a draft i want to have this that before do the first commi commit add the changes to be committed okay so that will be another commit i have to do now i have new modifications you can see here new modifications so again git add and then again git and then again git commit and now let's call that the third version okay it's all done but we have the file changed here the last version the version 3 in brand 3 brand b but now let's return back to master but before do that let's do the following git log git log give to us the information about all commits we have done and let's suppose we don't want to have the last version in the master that is this commit here we want to have this very specific version here that you have just added the add step 1.1 .1. so i'm going to copy just the id the identificator of this specific commit and we are going to save this this commit id now we are going to check out again to master okay now we have switched to master and as you may observe if i open the file again the changes we have done has disappeared because they have been done in the branch b but we are now in master so i want not to have all the changes of branch b but just one for one specific commit what should i do now now is the goal of this video we need to take the commit id and then we have to type here git cherry pick that's the comment and then here we inform the commit id you want to pick just that as you can see now i can open the file and this specific change has been committed so that was the goal of this video show to you how to use this cherry pick inside one context of one project creation with two different brands where we want to take just one very specific commit and import that copy that to another brand thank you for watching see you next time